Portugal is becoming more and more popular. It's one of those sort of undiscovered parts of Europe that is really magical, especially in this Alentejo region. It's a really unique place. The border is right there and you know, there's a lot of history and culture between Portugal and Spain. The landscape is incredible. You'll see like a lot of rolling hills. It's a mixture of cork trees, fruit trees, lots of olive trees as well. Just beautiful. Amongst that landscape, we see all these animals as well. You'll see cows and goats and black pigs. There's a whole stack of wildlife. The sorts of riders that will come on this trip are more recreational. It's more about sitting back on your bike, soaking up the atmosphere, enjoying some great food, some really good wine. Around Villa Vesosa, it's a huge marble region. The hotel where we stay is like amazing pink marble, which, which is absolutely marvellous. We make our way down to the Castello de Terrena, check out what life might have been like 200, 300 years ago. We head to the UNESCO town of Evora. We have an amazing walking tour. We get to see Roman ruins and the beautiful Roman temple of Diana. We go to this bone church and you can see on their faces, they're sort of like, whoa. That's a wall made out of someone's head. And it's incredible to see so much history. After having done the Portugal trip, the guests, they get a real sense of this part of the world. You fall in love with the people and you fall in love with their warmness and you know, you just want to come back again.